王様戦隊、キンオージャー。What's up, G-Fusion fans? This is Phil, and welcome back to another video. So, yes, we finally have information about the newest Super Sentai series coming in 2023, which is Osama Sentai King Oger. So, if you haven't checked it out yet, I'm gonna leave you guys a link down in the description so you can read about it. So, of course, this is my personal reaction to the news, and I will、uh, be mentioning some details. Uh, you, you could probably read about it as well. So, anyways, let's move on with the video. So, again,、uh, Toei just recently revealed、uh, Osama Sentai King Oger. So, first off, so the theme,、uh, so from the name alone, so there's King in the title. So,、uh, the suits already look、uh, majestic and、uh, royalty like. So,、uh, there's definitely. Going to be some kind of, I, I do think there's going to be some kind of mystical setting, like、uh, some magic involved. Like、uh, the Rangers kind of have to.、Uh, so, because the weapons that you see in the poster, so they're going to be using swords. So,、uh, it seems that they're going to go for the King Arthur style, with,、uh, in which you have to pull the swords from the stones where they belonged or where they were. And this kind of reminds me of、uh, Gingaman or Power Rangers Lost Galaxy, where you do have to pull the sword from the stone, it, which basically is uh, your uh, main weapon. And if I am correct in assuming so,、uh, these swords will also be the transformation devices.、Uh, so the first thing I noticed that. Uh, when, when I saw the swords, was that they look like Kamen Rider Saber's uh, uh, Seiken, uh, particularly uh, the ones used for Rekka, Nagare, and the Ikazuchi, because they're of、uh, the three swords, you know, are of similar build and they're similar shape with only the hilt or the handguard being different. But What I also noticed about、uh, those weapons is that there are insect like devices on the hilt as well. So these could also be involved in the transformation process. Like you get the sword, for example, and you set that、uh, you know, insect device and you transform into a King Oger. But the design of it also reminds me of Kamen Rider Kabuto's Perfect Zector. You know, because it is a sword, although it also turns into a gun, and you do attach different sectors to it. So, again, you have insect devices on a sword as well. So,、uh, speaking of Kamen Rider Saber, there's already been a lot of jokes about Kamen Rider Saber way back when, you know, when it、uh, came out.、Uh, people have been joking that it's It's basically a Super Sentai because of the different colors and、uh, motifs of each rider. So now we literally have a Super Sentai that looks like Kamen Rider Saber.、Uh, you do have uh, somewhat uh, similar looking swords. You also have capes, although、uh, they are more similar to Kamen Rider Espada because all of them have their capes on the left side. So. Uh, now, moving on to the motif of each ranger. So, it turns out that there's also going to be an insect motif. So,、uh, for the first time in Super Sentai history, we are going to have a team with insect motifs. So, the Red Ranger, especially based on the uh, robots uh, featured on the co cover or the poster, so the main. Uh, robot, especially、uh, the Red Ranger, is of a stag beetle motif. I'm not very sure about the other Rangers,、uh, blue, black, and yellow, but、uh, what's interesting about this is if you notice the poster, for the first time, we are going to have a violet or probably purple Ranger as part of the main team because、uh, this Ranger doesn't look Pink. So, assuming that this character is going to be female,、uh, because I really can't tell because of all that armor, 
this uh, uh, purple or violet ranger has a butter butterfly motif. So uh, again, I'm not sure about the other O uh, king uh, king ogres, but uh, I, I would assume that they would also have some kind of uh, insect motif. And uh, come to think of it, like uh, Bla uh, king ogre black. Let's uh, let's call them that for now. So uh, so black ogre or black king ogre or king ogre black, whatever you might want to call him, uh, may appear to have a dragonfly motif. If I'm not mistaken, if the designs on the eyes are not a clue enough, so I like you may be able to tell from their visors, but uh, red is a stag beetle. The purple ranger is of a butterfly motif, and the black ranger is uh, dragonfly. So again, uh, I'm not sure what the blue and yellow uh, rangers' motifs are, but uh, I'm assuming that they're going to be bugs as well. So I did mention earlier that uh, the suits are also armored. Uh, if you compare to uh, Dawn Brothers, so... Toei is really leaning into the armored suit motifs, uh, making them closer to common Riders at this point. So, I, I mean, this has been quite the trend since, uh, like, maybe even a Zenkaiger. Although, uh, the armors are quite specific, uh, especially with the Zenkaiser uh but you will see with the King Ogers, there seems to be a lot more armor on them right now. But I don't mind that, really. So uh, we still get like a uniform, uh, you know, motif. Like the suits are still very much similar to each other. Of course, they have their own unique twists given, you know, each ranger is unique. But uh, we are uh, most likely going to see more armored uh, Sentai suits uh, moving forward, which again, I don't mind. The like Super Sentai suits are evolving. Uh, gone are the days when uh, suits are purely uh, spandex, and uh, again, gradually armors were being added. So, well, Kira Major had some armor parts on, especially with the shoulders. Uh, again, uh, Zenkaiger had uh, more armored-looking suits, although this is especially true with Zenkaiser and Zenkai, Zenkai Red. Uh, Stacy, if you could consider him part of the Zenkaigers, uh, he also has a lot of armor, surprisingly. Uh, I would say uh, Tsukaiser is the only one who's closer to a more traditional uh, Sentai suit, well, although he is quite similar to uh, the Kira Majors in in the uh, in that regard, where uh, only the armors are, or only the shoulders have armors. But anyways, King Oger has more armor on the suits. So we also now have a release date or a, a premiere date. So uh, King uh, King Oger is going to come out March. 5 2023 so uh don brothers actually has uh, kind of revealed or leaked uh the remaining episodes so we are going to have 50 episodes uh for uh, don brothers so by that time so it's gonna end around late february so we uh, assuming that uh, you know uh, march 5 is the air date for uh, King Oger. So yeah, somewhere around the last week of February. So the last Sunday of February is going to be the last episode of uh, Dawn Brothers. So, uh, well, I'm actually, well, I'm excited to see uh, how Dawn Brothers uh, is going to end and how uh, King Oger will begin. So yeah, uh, if uh, there are any other updates, so we'll let you know. So anyways, that's going to be it for this video. Again, a link to the Ono uh, King Oger news will be down in the description. 
As always, this has been Philip. Thank you so much for watching. Make sure to leave a like, comment, subscribe, and uh, share this video. Don't forget that notification bell so you get the latest from JE Fusion. Again, thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye!